Hello everybody, my name is Sasha and welcome to my channel. And today I'm going to show to you like we will have a tour in their typical American dorm. So this is our house in front of which I'm standing now. And uh, we can go in and check like kind of what's there. So how it looks from the inside. Because from the outside I think it looks pretty gorgeous. Uh, I think the history of the house uh, like kind of says that before there lived some family so and all of these rooms which uh, it has now and in which students are living now uh, before was uh, it was just like you know some family living here in this like fancy like three floors house so I think it's uh, pretty wealthy so to get in we all have these kind of cards and we need to put them here and only after that the door will unlock Okay, so in the first floor, uh, straight away, like in the right, we have uh, some sort of living room. It's uh, a bit messy, I apologize for that, <laughs> but um, here you can just kind of, you know, um, sit with your friends, I don't know, listen to music. Also here we have uh, some machines with uh, Pepsi and Cola, um, then, uh, well, here there is some like closet, it's empty, but I think that maybe students can put their, their food, you know, because we don't have fridges in our rooms, so maybe it's a great way to put some cookies there and to keep them there. So um, let's maybe go and check um, the first floor. Um, I was thinking about to show to you my own room, but maybe we can just go instead to some like, you know, random room because it doesn't matter, they all are safe. So yeah, and yeah, here we are. So this is some empty room in which nobody is living now because we just don't have that much people. Um, and you can see that it's pretty simple. So uh, my cameraman now can show the angle of the room. <laughs> um, and yeah, there is like two beds and uh, kind of two tables and. Uh, Nothing special, so but you can also see that for two people they as well have like two wardrobes, so everybody have the space to put their clothes and stuff and don't feel so bad that you know kinda their clothes not fitting in one shelf. But uh, for me probably <laughs> this uh, wardrobe it would be not enough because <laughs> at home I have two wardrobes so I would still have my clothes probably in the suitcase as well if I would live in this dorm myself. But yeah, so um, and in the rooms there is there <laughs> there are not <laughs> my cameraman almost killed herself, so <laughs> camera woman. Uh, in the rooms they don't have a shower or toilet, uh, which is sometimes uncomfortable because you need to share this. Um, utilities uh, with other people and uh, my cameraman don't kill yourself please let's turn and go and check the toilet oh yeah the toilet is here and I'm sorry there is some girl doing some makeup but we are going to disturb her a bit hello 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 <laughs> so um, maybe not to disturb her we can show the shower so this is their typical uh, shower which this dorm has it's uh, like pretty well it's okay like you know uh, you can feed there you can like do everything you need and uh, it looks a bit like a box so but it surprised me that it's super neat and clean because um, I expected that in the dorms you know especially in Russia for example the dorms are super dirty like super nasty and I already like prepared myself before we came here that it's going to be super horrible but it's clean it's nice you know uh, the water is cool there isn't any like kind of you know iron here so it's just fine and uh, here we have as well it's my favorite thing to show to you like some toilets in my videos so <laughs> there is like some toilets um, they're also pretty basic uh, I believe they have like in each bathroom like two toilets uh, and also uh, in each floor there is two bathrooms so like bathroom as we saw now with two like showers and two toilets and also one separate uh, like bathroom kind of just with one shower and with one toilet so I think it's for some privileges kids like you know who are living next to this 
um, bathroom. So yeah, and uh, well here we just have a mirror and uh, there's like two sinks and that's all. Yeah, let's not disturb my, <laughs> my <laughs> other <laughs> girl from the group. Yeah, also we have in the house, like, you know, the first question which disturbed me and bothered me a lot, kind of how I can wash my clothes, because um, I produce so much clothes that at home, like, I need to do laundry maybe like two or three times per week. And here uh, they have uh, laundry in the basement. So, and now we will go to you to the basement. But before that, um, I also want to show to you this awesome machine. It's a machine which produces water. So Americans uh, drink water in America from the tap. And uh, basically you can just go to the bathroom in which we visited now and uh, put the water in your bottle from the tap and it should be okay. But uh, they still have like all over their like university, you know, this kind of um, this kind of stuff, which we wish you can fill your bottles. But uh, what what kind of you know surprised me and shocking me a bit that in our dorm we have filters like status, you know, it's red. So probably it's pretty bad, but <laughs> we're Russians, we're still drinking from it, and nobody cares, nobody's calling, you know, to some service. But maybe we actually should do that. But yeah, let's go to the basement. Uh, it's uh, straight away, you know, after you and to like exit the house and uh, it's downstairs. Uh, here we also have a couple like other rooms. So there is like people living here and also on the other side. Um, and uh, th this is actually a cool way for the people who likes uh, cold, coldness, you know, to live in cold because um, in my third floor, it's like in sauna, it's very hot, but here it's a bit like, you know, cool. Um, and yeah, here we are. So uh, we have three washing machines, uh, which is uh, like, you know, if you want to wash your clothes, um, one time like washing will cost uh, $1.50. So, um, and if you want to dry your clothes, we also have some drying machines and it costs as well, you know, one time, uh, $1.50. So to wash your clothes once and to dry it once, it will cost uh, $3. Uh, which is a bit also, uh, well, it's not expensive maybe, but it surprised me as well because in Finland, um, these, you know, machines, they were standing like, you know, just in their uh, basement of the houses like as well, but it was for free. So you just needed to book uh, the time, kind of in some uh, schedule list, and uh, it was fine. So you just needed as well bring your own powder and uh, with powder you could do your laundry for free. But here you need to buy your own powder and also pay for, you know, machines. But that's fine. Um, here we also have some microwave. I'm not sure that somebody like ever used it, at least not our group, but um, yeah, you can use it as well. Uh, the house has no kitchen. So um, that's why I think it's the only place if you like want to warm up something or to cook something. So it's the only place where you can do that. Um, yeah. So and uh, on the other side, there is just uh, the way to kind of exit the house. Yeah, we have a light here so we can continue our trip. Um, and it looks a bit creepy, like if you would enter somebody's, you know, like kind of some killer's house, you know? It looks um, a bit not so cozy and stuff, but whatever. And here, you know, we just came kind of across the house. So it's nice that this house have uh, two exits. So in case if uh, the fire kind of will start here, uh, you have two ways to run away. So yeah, that was our tour, like to the American dorm like typical American dorms. Uh, I hope you liked it. Please give me a big thumbs up if you do. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, not to skip next videos, and see you guys soon. Bye!